Hey, how's it going everybody? It's Tanner here and welcome back to a new Ninjago Season 11 discussion video here on the channel. In today's video, we're going to be discussing something very important for the actual Season 11 plot and I think I might have figured out what exactly is going on in the Ice Chapter story. So essentially, in some of the newer Ninjago episodes that aired in a specific country that's not the United States, we actually got a lot of information regarding the backstories for Akita and General Vex. And I believe that these two backstories together will essentially make up the entire of what season 11's ice chapter is all about. So essentially I want to go ahead and back up a previous theory that I did on the channel in which I discuss how General Vex might be the real main villain of the entire season 11 story and that's because I firmly believe that he is actually up to something very very sketchy in the ice chapter story. So pretty much what we're looking at here is the fact that General Vex was potentially a failed formling. He was working with the formling tribes to try to find his animal form and never could find it. However, I do believe that he will find it eventually in the ice chapter story so we do know that there is a mysterious ice dragon that has been appearing in several pieces of marketing for season 11 we have the trailers the actual sets and i do believe that this dragon could be the animal form of general vex he could be using it to go ahead and seek out revenge on the formling tribe for you know betraying him but he didn't really i guess get all of the formlings he left one and that would be akita of course he might have akita's brother on lockdown in the prison just in case Akita's brother wanted to join him in some capacity, maybe teach him a little bit of the formling power, you know, something like that, just so we can go ahead and complete his, I guess, final transformation into his animal form, which could potentially be the ice dragon. The only thing going against this theory from what I can find is that the actual, I guess, dragon form itself appears in a set alongside General Vex as an actual minifigure, so I don't really know if that, I guess, cancels out this theory, but if it doesn't, then I do believe that the dragon is the animal form of the formling General Vex. And the reason why he might have captured Zane is because he wanted to go ahead and use Zane's power to, I guess, overthrow the formling army, just like how he did in the flashback sequence for Akita's backstory. He used the ice from Zane, otherwise known as the Ice Emperor, to try and go ahead and take over the entire Never Realm in order to unlock his animal form. I do believe that the overall, I guess, general consensus of Vex is that he wants to go ahead and overthrow the Never Realm and actually, I guess, become one of the strongest formlings out there and take on, I guess, the Formling army as his own. Formlings have a lot of power in Ninjago, and if General Vex wanted to harness that, he very well could harness that, essentially by, you know, killing all the Formlings except for one, which I'm not really sure if that was intentional or not, and then by framing Zane, otherwise known as the Ice Emperor, as I guess the main perpetrator behind the entire winter going on in the Never Realm, then by doing all that, he could probably go ahead and get away with it. Of course, I do firmly believe that General Vex is the overall main villain of the Ice Chapter. There's just too much going for his character that actually makes sense. You know, there's a lot that he does that kind of hints that maybe he could be pulling the strings behind everything going on. He seems to be convincing the Ice Emperor of what he needs to do instead of having, you know, the Ice Emperor just do it himself. Vex seems to be pulling the strings behind that, which might mean that General Vex is up to something even more sinister, and I do believe that that has to do with him truly finding his formling power and discovering his new form. And we will probably see that when the Ice Chapter wraps up. So thanks a lot for watching this video, guys. Let me know down below in the comments what you think about this theory. Do you think that General Vex could be the Dragon Formling? And do you believe that he's pulling the strings behind everything going on in the Ice Chapter? Feel free to leave all your thoughts down below regarding that. I look forward to reading what you guys come up with. With that being said, that'll just about do it for this video here, so thank you so much for watching this one. If you enjoyed the video, as always, don't forget to give it a huge thumbs up rating, and of course, remember to hit the subscribe button if you've not done so already. Once again, guys, the comment section is there for the various discussions that you would like to have regarding this topic, or if you just had a comment of a general nature, that's fine as well. In the description, you'll find the links towards my other forms of social media, whether it be my Twitter, my Instagram, my Patreon, or my merch. Be sure to support me on all those platforms if you would like to. With all that being said, you guys, thank you so much for watching this video. Once again, my name is Tanner Fishies, and with that, I bid you farewell.